Hey guys, it's Amber and I am back on YouTube. I know it's been so long since the last video that I did, which is all the way back uh, last year in October, which is, a, no wait, half a year counting from, I guess, today. Well, not exactly half a year, but somewhere around there. After I broke my camera, I just didn't feel like fixing it because I heard it's very expensive and the camera wasn't really that expensive to begin with. Right after that happened, my business started becoming just quite crazy and hectic. So I've just been busy with that up until now, of course, because um, I have been getting your comments and messages asking me when I'm going to do a video again. And I'm sorry it took me so long to buy a new camera and um, to start doing videos again. So I will be updating my YouTube channel as frequently as possible and um, doing free giveaways and stuff like that. What I will be reviewing today is the Shimera UV Light Bulb Foundation Compact and it just came out a couple days ago, uh, 17th. Started selling in major malls and stuff a couple days ago in Taiwan and I got my hands on one because I heard it's amazing. So I will be um, doing review and swatches and just the whole application process of that in the video. As you guys can see, my face is absolutely makeup free right now, but I've already prepped my skin for um, makeup application, so I will get started right now. Just because I've heard Shimera Light Bulb UV Compact Foundation has really, really amazing coverage, so I am actually going to skip the foundation part and just apply the foundation primer and just get straight to the compact. So I will be using only two products today and the first one is the Shumera Pore Eraser UV Under Base Mousse. It's this one and this uh, product is actually really really popular in Asia as well and uh, it's SPF 35 PA++++ and I am using the shade Beige and of course the light bulb UV Compact. It comes in two separate parts. Um, this part is the compact and this part is the refill, the compact refill. After you open it, the refill looks like this and so it looks like this after you open it and then you can take this part out and then put it in the compact. And the compact just looks like this. It's like a little cute um, kind of a, like a egg shaped compact and this is where you put the refill and the bottom is obviously the very very special sponge that they provided and what is so special about the sponge is that one side sorry as you can see I've used it already but um one side is just like a regular sponge but obviously this one just provides amazing coverage and it's really really easy to use with um, the compact and this side is made of satin and obviously just by looking at the color you can see the difference this this side is more of a beige color and this side is more white and you apply the compact with the sponge side first then use this to highlight parts that you want to highlight on your uh, on your face like your t-zone cheeks and stuff etc I am using the shade 574 and 574 looks like this and it's really neat how they provide this um, sticker on the back so when you put it into the compact it doesn't fall out so this is how the shade looks on my finger it's um just a uh, beigey shade more on the pink side and um, it's more on the pale fair side as well. I will get to applying the mousse on my skin right now. I'm going to start applying the Shimera Light Bulb UV Compact right now. My skin's condition is actually not that great. I have some um, light acne here and I have freckles and some acne scars here and some scars here as well. 
So let's see how this compact performs without the foundation because I've heard that it's actually like the liquid light bulb foundation but in a compact form. Like I said earlier, start with the sponge side and just apply it all over your face. And I remember I taught you guys this trick with compacts uh, in one of my earlier videos and it's that when you apply compact powder, do not go like this when you're applying. Stamp on your face like the sponge is like a stamp and just do this rather than doing this. Just finished applying the compact, the sponge side, all over my skin and I have to say the effect is absolutely amazing. It does not look very powdery, it just goes on like a foundation, at least the after effect looks like foundation and the coverage is incredible. Like you guys can see pretty much like 80, at least 80% of um, the flaws of my skin are covered, even my dark eye circles. I'm just gonna bring it closer so you guys can see. Obviously, for something as big as this, um, you will have to use a decent concealer to cover it up, but I mean, it just saves a lot of time. Like, you don't need to apply foundation and you can just quickly just stamp, 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 and um, if your skin's condition is good, you don't have too much scars and stuff, you're good to go. Like, you can just head out the door. And so, um, I am very, very pleased with the performance of this compact, I think what I heard about this compact really proves to be true. I will try the satin side now. Again, just lightly dab into the compact. Apply on the area that you want to highlight. And what I always do is just um, the forehead area above my eyebrows and my T-zone area and my chin. So just go like this, and some here, and that's it, I'm done. I don't know if you guys can see the difference on the camera, but at least in my mirror, I can definitely see that this part, like the parts where I highlighted, does appear to be highlighted and it really brings out my features. Incredible! I have to say I give this compact powder a 5 out of 5. It's so easy to apply. It's not dry like a lot of the powder compacts that I've used before in the past. It's extremely hydrating. You don't need to worry about the compact leaving fine lines and wrinkles or creases under your eyes and it just climbs on and it's so easy to smooth out. Definitely highly recommend this product. Anyone who just needs a, a compact powder or finish using theirs or just anybody who is looking to try something new or if you've already purchased the Shumera Light Bulb Foundation, you can definitely match this product with the foundation to get a better result. For the review of this Shimmera light bulb UV compact and I am not sure if it's available for sale right now in other parts of the world but we just started selling in the malls and stuff I'm like on the 17th so that's three four days ago anyways I will leave the purchase link down below in the description section and if you are very interested and would like to purchase one um, you can on it and it will lead you straight to the purchasing link page of this product. So I just want to let you guys know what I will be giving away today. It's just a Shimura cosmetic pouch full of little samples of their best selling products. It's got the um, hydrating toner, the cleansing oil. I love their cleansing oil. I use that on a daily basis to re remove my makeup and it's so strong that 
And what I mean by strong is not that um, it's very intense or it hurts your eyes or anything like that or your skin. Uh, what I mean by strong is that it's able to remove any sort of uh, super waterproof stuff. I use very strong uh, false lash glue and I find that Jumeirah's cleansing oil is the only one that's strong enough to really get rid of all the glue on my lashes and stuff like that. This is what I will be giving away today. It's got tons of goodies in there and it's very simple. You either subscribe my channel or like my Facebook page of my beauty shop or just give me a comment on the video or just about anything that's cosmetic or skincare related um, just down below and a winner will be selected randomly. I have noticed that some of you guys do message me on my Facebook page just letting me know who you are for liking my page and I think that's a great idea so if you want me to know you like my page uh, you can just private message me on my Facebook page and I will know who you are and uh, could possibly be a winner of my free giveaway. Well, that's it for the rambling and I hope you guys enjoy the review today. If you guys want to purchase this product um, the purchasing link is down below in the description description box and I'm sorry it took me so long to come back but I've really missed you guys and uh, one last thing before I go is I want to thank everyone who has purchased from my shop and has been supporting me since day one I started up this um, business of my own or just anybody who has purchased from my shop but is not satisfied with my service I sincerely apologize for that but it's just I try my best to um, give the best service as possible but sometimes I do miss things and stuff like that so I ask for your forgiveness and understanding and I will definitely improve on anything that my shop is lacking so anyways enjoy the review today and I will see you guys soon bye